What's up guys, Spyro101881 here. I've got four of these 1.45 inch, I'm sorry, 1.4G 5 inch shells from Red Apple Fireworks. I got a gold tail to sky blue to brocade crown. I got silver tail to brocade crown with sky blue. I got gold tail to magenta to brocade crown. And I got gold tail to titanium gold willow with white strobe. So I'm gonna get these fused up together, zip tied together. Um, I'm gonna test my firing system today. What I, I really wanna know is if my firing system will fire two cues, and the, or I'm sorry, two uh, electronic matches in the same queue. I know I've seen videos on YouTube that says it can, but I just wanna make sure, because my finale kinda depends on it, I want I want to have, I'll show you the video later what I want to do, but I need to plug in two, two ports into each queue. So we're gonna take this for a spin and see how it goes. All right, I'm gonna fuse these up in the back of my car real quick and then I'll set them off. What up, what up guys? Okay, so I did a real quick, real sloppy fuse job on this, on both of these mortars. I just wanted to get them fused together real quick. Uh, I got a little bit of a lull in the rain, so, um, so I gotta hurry. But I got my firing system, I got good continuity here. Switch to test. Let me see. Come on. Oh, the green light's on on Q1. I've got both talons plugged into Q1. So I'm going to go test it. Let's check it out. Okay, guys. Here we go. I got a nice little low in the rain here. Got my firing system set up. Now you can't see it, but trust me, it's set up. I got my mortar right there, which you also can't see. So I'm going to hit Q1. And we'll see if it works. It worked. Okay guys, so I know you couldn't tell from the video probably because it was really dark and it just sucked, but the, the firing system worked wonderfully. I did plug uh, both I fused them up separately and I did plug them both into port one here and they both went off with fire successfully which I'm really really happy about. That being said, and I know you guys couldn't tell from the video, but uh, I was a little upset with the performance on this 1.4G 1.4G 5 inch uh, canister shell, honestly. the uh, It's raining, or it was raining all day and maybe it's the humidity, I don't know, but they seem to break low, and I don't mean low for a five inch shell, I mean low for any canister shell. And I only fired three, so I, I wired up four, or I fused up four, but only three fired. One of them, the, the fuse just stopped stopped burning at about five inches, and it didn't, light, it didn't go off. And I don't know why, I don't, again, I don't, I don't know what's going on. It lit, the firing system lit it, it just stopped. So maybe the fuse got wet, it's not raining anymore, but there's humidity in the air. Maybe it's, I don't know, maybe it got wet. But um, you guys will see in the video, there's uh, seemed to be a lot of debris, a lot of stuff still on fire blowing into my neighbor's yards, uh, places where I couldn't control where it went. And that kind of bothers me. Uh, it bothers me less today because it's been raining all day. But in general, it, it bothers me. And it, you know, the, the idea of five inch shells, or at least my idea behind the five inch shell is the, the shell goes high enough to where everything's burned out by the time it touches the ground. Now, I will say this, I fired off those five inch neon fusion shells and they were perfect. They were everything I expected from a five inch canister shell. They were everything I expected from a Red Apple Fireworks product. Uh, these ones though, I'm not thrilled about. Maybe I just got a bad batch. Maybe it was just those three, maybe it's the humidity. I'm gonna wait till it dries out and do another test with maybe just one or two shells and just light them up the old fashioned way. Um, I wanna see what these do before I go lighting off 20 or 30 of them at a time. It, it kind of freaked me out. And I, like I said, I'm all about safety or as safe as you can get with, with fireworks. And uh, I, I wasn't a huge fan of the, the debris, the, the smoldering debris, debris flying all over. And it was a wide radius. If you go back and look at the video, I, like I said, I know it's hard to tell, but stuff was blowing all over and I'm not, I'm not a huge fan of that. I'm not trying to set anybody's house on fire, you know, or anybody's yard or anything like that. So let me know what you guys think in the comments. Uh, I'll do another test tomorrow. It's supposed to dry out 
and uh, we'll see maybe that had some effect on it, but I just don't know yet. All right. <laughs>